There are many fundamental differences between Western blade making and Japanese bladesmithing. One of those is when and where the grinding of the secondary and primary edges take place. Generally speaking, in Western blade making, the knives are ground and shaped to between 75 and 90% of their completed dimensions before the steel is quenched and hardened. Conversely, Japanese blades typically are quenched in their full thickness and then all of the secondary and primary edge grinding happens after they're hardened. Because of that, it's very important that Japanese blades are ground in such a way as the blades are never heated past 180 degrees Celsius. If they're heated beyond that point, the temper will be negatively affected and the blade will become uh, softer than desired. They're usually ground with an abundance of water. For example, in the case of the rotating water stones that actually rotate in a trough of water.